Welcome back everybody to The Witcher 3. We stand here with Roach's name inside of us and this guy's crazy beard staring straight into our soul. Thank you for all your support. Make sure that thumbs up button if you're enjoying the beautiful world of Geralt's kingdom. We're here seeking Yennefer at the Nilfgaardian stronghold. We'll ascend the steps and see what we can find. Last time gained a little bit of info uh, from the end. Do any of these guys have anything to say? Hello? What do you want? What do you want? I want to talk. Okay. So not everyone is dialogable, if that's a word. I like how they just have random stuff like scattered about, like little bricks or shards Military of wood. Camp. No locals allowed without the express consent of the garrison commander. I look like a local to you. You look like trouble. Dead wrong. I make trouble go away. I'm a witcher. A witcher? Captain Peter Sugwin Levy is in the tower. Turn right, past the gate. Huh. You black ones aren't so scary after all. Can even be nice if you want to. Don't get accustomed, Nordling. To the tower. Go. Man, I like these old times. You didn't have to show an ID, no passport, no nothing. You're like, I'm a witcher. And they're like, okay, proceed. <laughs> this is pretty awesome. The griffin attacked again? What? Look at this guy sharpening his sword. Dude, that's a sharp sword. Look at this, all these layers, like even through these windows, people are doing stuff. That is a truly lived in RPG world. Impressive CD project, impressive. Right, so this is the camp of these guys. This guy must be in charge because he's got a cool horns on his helmet. Warming his hands even though it's 10 a.m. and feels like it's sunny and hot outside. A random shoe. Someone has lost their shoe. Maybe it was you. Ooh, look at this guy. Enhancing weapons. Use special grindstones to temporary enhance your weapons. Alright. Thanks for the ingredient. Quartermaster. Craftsmen can craft a variety of items for you for a small fee. Blacksmiths, armors, yada yada, buda bada. Password. Don't know any. So, out for a little walk, eh? Counting the Emperor's swords to lull you to sleep? Well, in the army, we have a place for nosy ramblers. The scaffold. And thick-skulled quartermasters. They got a place. <laughs> uh, you're clearly skilled at banter. And <laughs> haggling? You got a knack for that as well. Ooh, I can haggle. Let's show me what you got. Show me what you're peddling. Probably nothing we need at this point. Ooh, new sword. So yeah, all of this inventory management seems like it's going to come into play probably later on in this story. These things, uh, where's their cost? 66 coinage. Required level one. So what is my sword currently? I don't even have equipment. It's just a generic sword. We'll mess with this later. Probably not the time. So long. So long, partner. I'm headed up to meet the main man in charge. How much grain will your village give? Whatever you say, Your Excellency. Look at my hands. Look. See the calluses? These are not the hands of an Excellency, but of a farmer. So we speak peasant to peasant. How much can you give? Forty bushels. There'd be more, sir, but our lads, the Temerians, that is, took from us earlier and... You will give thirty, and that will do. Let us settle on it. And I wish to see the transport soon. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you kindly. I summoned only the Elderman and the Smith, Willis. But it is said he is a dwarf. You are too tall to be him. Hmm. Very perceptive of you. Geralt of Rivia, Witcher. That girl. This explains why I did not hear your footsteps. What do you seek here? Yennefer of Vengerberg. Where was she headed? That is a military secret. Haven't thrown me out yet. Haven't called the guards. So go ahead. What's your price? There is a griffin in the area. Slay it. And then I shall see what I can do. Hmm. Why do you care about this griffin? Because I care about people. The beast has killed ten already. Including a few of my men. To hunt it, I would need to mobilize the entire garrison, comb the woods, organize a batu. Simply impossible. Too big a hassle? No. Too high a risk. I 
cannot disperse my forces. Demeria's army we have crushed, but its common folk remain, ready to answer a call to arms. So, as to this griffin, I can sit on my hands, or hire a professional. Aha. It's a deal. Some questions before I start. Know where the griffin has its lair? It kept to the vulpine woods at first. I sent a patrol there, five young men. A hunter found them two days on. They only recognized them because they wore our plate. Since then, the griffin has grown bold. Attacks in villages, fields, on the main road. Meaning it's abandoned its lair. Gonna have to set a trap. I judge from your tone this will not be easy. What do you require? This griffin is getting bold and boisterous, terrorizing the people. <sighs> info or herbs? Let's take some info, because as of now, I have no clue where to go. Need more information about this griffin. It's sex. Why it's abandoned its lair. Shall I bring you witnesses? They won't say anything I don't already know. I need to go where your men died. Look around. What's the name of the hunter who found them? Mislov. He has a hut south of the village, very near the wood. Helpful fellow. A little strange, though. All right. I'll need bait. A specific herb. Buckthorn. Scent should lure the griffin from ten miles off. Buck... Buckthorn? <laughs> I do not know this. But I am not yet fluent in the common tongue. Mm -hmm. Probably mastered the basics, though. Hands up. Kill them. No. First came idioms. Don't play with fire. For example, go to Tomira, an herbalist. She lives near the crossroads. She will aid you. All right, sounds like a plan, sir. Tomira so long. and Mislav. Thanks. It is appreciated. All right. Click in the right stick to decide where we want to go. Ask the hunter, ask the herbalist. Ask the hunter, ask the herbalist. I want to know what this buckthorn is. Um, sometimes Geralt's momentum gets the best of him. I wish he kind of didn't have that momentum. I know that they add momentum to games for realism. Um, I actually heard Giant Bomb talking about this, but I would kind of prefer if they just didn't have it, because you can take him it, It's just like, I would rather him just be very precise to control, even if it's not the most realistic thing in the world. Ooh, there's a bridge we can cross the way, or maybe not. Well, we could jump it. But rather than risk my own two legs, uh, I'm going to head down to my horse and pursue the path of the herbalist. Uh, Geralt's beard apparently grows and thickens as the adventure continues, which has to be one of the coolest parts of this game. Very excited for that. Fast travel. Once discovered, signposts allow you to travel amongst the world. Nice. Alright. Um, can I fast travel... Probably don't have that many places there. Where am I headed? Can I see my... Okay, cool. Whoa. Yeah, I gotcha. Can... Let's... Wow. Zoom me in. Do I have to, like, hit on this? Oh, oh the region maps. I gotcha. There's multiple region maps. Interesting. Um, so this is the Beast of White Orchard. So let's go straight to the sawmill here. We'll see how the, uh, the low temps are. See, when the time of the white frost comes, do not eat the yellow snow. So yes, there will be snow. We talked about that last uh, episode, and there will be. I'm 50 meters, 48 paces, whatever they want to call it, uh, by foot from this place. We'll hit this road. I could call my horse if we double tap the left stick. Uh, he appears. Roach, that lady has the hiccups. Roachy, what's up, buddy? All right, let's ride him the last 33 steps to the herbalist here and hey we're here <laughs> that was really fast roach be good don't eat any of the pots or plants bad time not at all hand me the beggar tickets the red bloom well well one versed in herbs probably saying too much but i know a bit for instance that beggar ticks poisonous in large doses Small ones soothe pain and bring forth pleasant dreams. Which is all I can hope to do for her. 
Looking for buckthorn. Know if it grows anywhere around here? Hmm. Bottom of the river, where the channel's widest. But you do know that once out of the water... It'll stink worse than a weak old carcass. Counting on it. I'm hunting the griffin. Need the buckthorn for bait. I was thinking... A few years ago, we had trouble. Drowners under the bridge. A whole village had to pitch in for a witcher. Who now can afford the bounty on a griffin's head? Captain Peter Sar... something, something. Ah, good to know the Black One's looking out for our welfare. Mm-hmm. He seems to be a good guy. That captain, we have to admit, like, he was definitely... his heart was in the right place. Doubt Emperor Amir cares about you. But this captain just might. Seems like a decent man. There are no decent men in the army. There are only orders. Hmm, interesting point. Not from here, are you? A lot of bitterness in you. Too much for someone who spent her life in a hut in the middle of nowhere. True. And you're in a hurry. Elsewise you'd not use bait, just wait for the griffin to attack again. Believe we could have an interesting conversation. Maybe next time. All right, inside Geralt's hair lies the magical herb knowledge that we just displayed. And now it looks like we have to ask the hunter uh, where the bodies are. Is this considered stealing if I loot this? I don't know. I'm not going to risk it. Roach! Stop playing in the fields. Flowers are not food. They are friends. Yeah, and we're off. 221 paces to the hunter. And go, we go. will make our way towards this griffin. I like that they're getting us accustomed to hunting monsters, big beasts right away early on in the game and we start off in a very like uh, kind of peasant filled Faster. area this isn't a glorious big city but I'm assuming that at some point we will come across things of that nature which should be pretty darn cool this griffin is ruthless he does not care about anybody and he definitely definitely doesn't care about how he disfigures his prey as evidenced by the captain only recognizing them based on their markings we're at the hunters house now tell me about the bodies anyone home must be out hunting huh use your witcher senses to find the hunter okay footprints trails fresh Ms. Love just left home all right so let's follow miss love's trail here through the woods it kind of gives this weird like fisheye perspective which is a bit odd here it is the blood red trail it's like eagle vision, but witcher vision, apparently. Here he is! I found you, Ms. Love. You, Ms. Love? Shh! Hear that? Yes. Wolves. No, wild dogs. Yes, more dangerous than wolves. I'm hunting bigger game. The Nilfgaardians the Griffin killed. Where'd you find them? Ah, I see. You a witcher. That monster slayer they's talking about in the village. Mm -hmm. I'll show you, sure. But, uh, I gotta kill those mutts before they hurt someone. Will you help? That is, if you don't mind blunting your silver blades on them? Sure, why not? Sure. Griffin's not going anywhere. No. Dogs might, though. So step careful now. Come on. All right. These dogs been a problem for a while now. Since the war started, soldier on the march, he'll stop to rape a woman, strangle her, kill her man for a chuckle, even butcher a cow. But a dog, a kick in passing, no more. So these stray mutts form packs. They're gaunt, guts stuck to their spines, covered in scabies, and they just need to so let awesome. attack another one. All right. Look how cool this world is. All the different colors, all the lushness, the foliage, the fauna, the flora, everything is brilliant here. At least in terms of the environment. Alright, where is he going? Killing the dogs? There they are. See him? There they are. Ah! Slice and dice make everything nice, and I'm gonna have to be careful. I forgot these guys mean business. Oh, that's a big sword. Ow, man. I can't even see you, dog. Hey. It's a little bit quick on his feet. There we go. I'm getting the hang of the combat a little bit. Looks like there's one more up this way. Hey. Can't really... Ooh, wow. Mislav with that shot. 
Nicely done, dude. -er. That was a good hit, buddy. Oh! Where'd they come from? Dieter. You know him. We served at the Lord's Manor together, where the Black Army's encamped now. He was a stable hand, I was the Lord's hunter. But that was before... Well, a long time ago. Oh dear. Before what? Before they drove me from the village. What did you do? Nothing. I'm a freak. Sorry. I'd rather not talk about it. He's a freak. Yeah, I guess we kind of are too. I'm a freak too. Why? But of another kind. If it's lycanthropy, I can help. What? Lycanthropy. Werewolves. Handled a few cases in the past. It's usually a simple curse that... The Lord's son, Florian, and I... We loved each other. Dieter walked in on us in the stables. They drove me away. Florian hanged himself. Lord started drinking, and the estate fell into ruin. That's the long and short of it. Interesting. Well, then, I'm sorry for misfortune. Let's move along. So, can you show me where you found the Nilf Guardians? We will follow Ms. Love Griffin, and spend our no first about it. ability point. Not my kind of game. You're his kind, though. Survival instincts alone will uh. make you care. I walk silent through the woods. No griffin can hear me nor spy me. We will follow Ms. Love and hunt the griffin when we return, guys and girls. Thank you so much for watching. Hit that thumbs up button if you want to see more. Be sure to enjoy yourselves today. Drink some hot chocolate. Until next time, thanks again. We'll see you all later.